we go. Oh, he's gonna blast him. Oh, no. Nah, he's too low. Can't make it. Too low. Oh, well, yep, I'm, uh, I'm, I'm, I'm way too low. Uh, uh, <laughs> <laughs> All right, we're here in Westburg, Virginia today. The best storage place around, number two in the country, and number three in the nation. I'm about to bring home merchandise and kick Dave's butt. He thinks he knows everything, but mm-mm, mm-mm. I'm about to win. I'm going to the top today. Storage units. Mm-mm, nope. that's what I like. Hi there. I'm Dave. I came here to win today. See, I know things they don't know. I've seen things they ain't seen. I'm taking home that money today. You can count on it. Feels good to be a gangster. A real gangster type player plays his cards right. A real gangster type player never runs his mouth. Cause real gangsterized players don't start fights. Don't be breaking that speed limit. He's got a high cap. Showing all his boys how we shot him. But real gangster type players don't flex that. Cause real gangster like players know they got him. Now everything is cool in the mind of a gangster. Cause gangsterized players think deep. You get my money. <laughs> I know where we can take them. Where? Rick. Let's go. How can I help you today? Well, I bought a storage unit and something it died. Hmm. Just mysteriously died. Sounds like it could be valuable. And we need to get it valued. Hmm. Okay? Let's have a look. Yes, you can. <laughs> I got it right here. I don't know what it is. Looks like a man or a little person. Oh, well, it looks like you got here is a dead Isaac Newton. Now, I'm no expert, but I do have a buddy who's an expert on these things, so uh, if you don't mind, I, I like to call him down. Perfect. Ben, what's the deal? Ben, do you think this is a joke? No. Points, Ben. Points. That's minus... You're dead to me. You're boxing your whole box. Dead to me. Oh, Rick, what's up? Hey, man. I just, uh... I have this dead Isaac Newton here. I was wondering if you could tell me a few... Whoa! A few things about it. Mm. Don't let it touch me. Looks like a child. Don't like childs. Child. Hey, Chase! Chase! What do you think this is? Joke? Mm -hmm. Alright. Being the expert in Isaac Newton that I am, I can tell you that he has three laws. <laughs> and the first law is an object will stay in motion or at rest unless acted upon by an outside object. I'm not going to get hurt. Ready? You got it? Ow. <laughs> an example for the first law would be, if you guys know like an endless surface, like 
bowling alley. Like, pretend like it goes on forever and there's no friction. That ball will continue to roll unless it's acted upon by an outside force. Chase! Do you think it's funny? Play the phones? Give me your phone, Chase! Is this Ben's phone? No. <laughs> Good one. Good one. It's oh. mine. I like taking phones. <laughs> Raw number two. F equals MA. Simple. Yeah, what time is it? But how do you expect me to know what time it is? Oh, wait. I have my new phone. <laughs> <laughs> Referral! Don't make me write it, because I will. Then I rip it up, because I don't like to give referrals. But children piss me off. Bit. I swear, <laughs> force is equal to mass times acceleration. Oh, children will get that through your heads. We can move on to the next unit. Alright. Law number three. <laughs> every object Whoa. or every action has an equal and opposite <laughs> reaction. <laughs> Yeah, we got motion on deck. Ryan, where are you? And for that law, you could say if two balls were flying at each other, they'd bounce off. And you can see that Isaac Newton was a... So what? Isaac Newton is a zombie! Who are we going to get to help us? We need some official advice. From the greatest zombie killer ever, Mr. R. We need Mr. R. As in common courtesy. You smell like sausages. What did you eat today? <laughs> Pepperidge Farm. Mr. R. I think I got the hang of this. Let's see what you got. All right. Well, the zombie. Oh. oh. Give me that. Give me the sausage strike. Oh my gosh, Sandra, you just say I'm a witch like it's a bad thing. Hey, I'm Marty Huggins. I am a storage unit investor, and I like to get a little practice for the big storage unit buy. I like to get some M&Ms in the morning. Three. Now I like to come down by the tree and grab this. Now you're probably wondering, what is he doing with the Christmas present? Well, I'll tell you. You get the Christmas present, you shake it around, and then you can find out what's inside. Like I bet this is a turtleneck sweater just for me with giraffes. And I know this polka dot one, it's a little blast for my daughter. I'm not just saying that because I bought them, but you can expect me to win. Are uh, we here in uh, Fredericksburg, Virginia? Best storage places around, number two in the country, number three in the nation. <laughs> like when Brumbra hits the pool, she kind of bounces up a little bit because the pool is <laughs> surface tension.
And if you all heard the Master P song, Woo Wee, or make them say, Uh, uh, so na na na, it would make a lot of sense. And also, this one is very pertinent to Crossfire. The Crossfire, you're shooting at each other, they bounce off, you got the guns, you're like, Ooh, ooh, ooh. D doesn't even doesn't even and you're just Thomas you see Walking Dead this weekend dog <laughs> dog did I I live that shit okay. me and Wessel surviving Wessel and I Ben if I hear another word you're dead to me you no noob all right what? Ben are you challenging the law. I, I am the law. I know. Don't don't challenge that. Why? And, oh, hey, what's up, Hibba? I swear, Ben. Hibba, <laughs> can you do something with the smack Ben? She's not so worried. If Hillary were here, she would smack you with her step team feet. That's over here.